What's up guys, Sammy Mong here, back with some Overwatch for you guys. Oh, look at that beautiful headshot and another one. Can we go for the long range? Oh, we can go for the long range headshot. But we're back with two quick tips for Hanzo and Genji. And it's all revolved, oh, I was about to say it's all evolved. No, it's all revolved around the jumping. So, the problems I've been having with uh, Genji, Genji, Genji and Hanzo is the fact that when uh, a close and personal character comes close to you, say Tracer, Reaper, Soldier 76, you're going to have problems shooting them. They're going to be moving around left to right. You're not going to be able to land an arrow quite as easy. But then I found out that, or I didn't find out, I found that if I also am, am jumping left and right, trying to trail my shots to obviously hit them, it's a lot harder for them to hit me. And what I've actually done in this scenario is gone to my options, gone onto controls, gone onto Hanzo, so there we go here, and I've changed his jump to the left trigger. So the left trigger is usually the secondary fire. So say you're on Genji, you shoot the three sort of you shoot the three shurikens more spreadly rather than in a line. That's his secondary fire, whereas Hanzo doesn't have one. So now I can go out, I can jump with my left trigger while still having my thumb on the right thumb stick. Rather than having to move it off the right thumb stick to obviously press X and jump. So now when I'm being attacked by an up close and personal character, I can jump around like this dodge all their bullets and hopefully not get killed yeah but also I've done this with Genji now it's a little different with Genji for the pure fact that he does have a secondary fire so if we go into all heroes go into Genji and look I've actually set it to L3 so when I click in my L3 button Genji will jump so let's switch to Genji quickly Huzzah! Here we go. So there we go. Click an L3. Genji jumps. And now, if I am being attacked by a Tracer, Soldier 76, up close and personal Winston, a Reaper, I can jump around as they're trying to move and strafe to shoot me. And it just makes it harder for them to hit you. And it makes it a lot more accurate for you, of course, because you've got your right thumb still on the stick and not pressing X to jump. So you can actually control where you're aiming when you jump. I hope this helps you out guys, I know I know it's helped me out, but if it has, be sure to leave a like down below, and if you want to see any more Overwatch madness, be sure to subscribe to our channel, but until next time, thanks, and I'll see you on the next video.